And Jamestown's mayor is responding to reports that a local development group may have violated their conflict of interest policy when they approved funding to businesses connected to their own board members. This week, WRFA first reported that the Jamestown Local Development Corporation appears to have violated their own bylaws when they approved grants to a slew of businesses. Specifically, three separate allotments of $64,000, $15,000, and then $9,400 were made to a local wedding planner business, skate product shop, and church, respectively. While board members tied to each entity, Councilman Jeff Russell, Pete Shira, and Rector Luke Fodor recused themselves of a vote on these allocations, the JLDC bylaws strictly prohibit awarding funding to anybody connected to or that has a relation to a sitting board member. Now, in a statement yesterday, Jamestown Mayor Eddie Sunquist said the allotments were made under the knowledge the funds were awarded appropriately and under legal and federal standards. Now, the mayor went on to thank the public that brought these issues to attention and said, quote, if there are any disparities or actions contrary to law, we'll work to rectify those issues as soon as possible, end quote. Now, in the end, the mayor also said he believes the grants were done in a transparent and public process and were being made for the benefit of local business and the good of the public.